Grace, thank you. Well, later this morning, the Anderson Police Department will say goodbye to one of their own, Sergeant Ethan Kaskin. He's a detective who died in a crash just last week in Fox Carolina's Michelle Zhu is live at the Anderson Civic Center with more on today's funeral services. Michelle. Ted, Sergeant Ethan Kaskin will be greatly missed by his family and fellow officers, and we are already seeing an outpouring of support by the look of the parking lot. We have seen officers pull up from several jurisdictions, including right here in Anderson, the Sheriff's Department and police, as well as Belton Police and Hendersonville uh, from North Carolina, even a Sheriff's uh, Office patrol car from Tennessee. So Sergeant Kaskin will be laid to rest with full police honors this morning right here at the Anderson Civic Center. Troopers say Sergeant Kaskin had just wrapped up a workout last Friday and was on his way home on Highway 24 to prepare for his shift. However, a driver crossed over the center line and hit him head on. He died there on the scene. The other driver now charged with driving left of the center line. The police chief says Sergeant Kaskin will be remembered for his devotion to his community. Kaskin leaves behind his wife, children, and grandchildren. They received friends yesterday evening at the McDougal Funeral Home. Today's funeral service will be at 11 o'clock here at the Civic Center in just a few short hours. Also, Kaskin's obituary says he was an animal lover, so his family asks that instead of flowers, people make a donation in his name to Paws of Anderson because that was a cause so dear to him. A full procession will begin at McDougal Funeral Home at 10 o'clock in just about an hour and a half from now. And then we do expect full police honors right here at the Civic Center at 11 o'clock this morning. We'll be there for that. You can stay tuned with Fox Carolina for all of those funeral services. Back to you.